Hey, I'm back again still talking about finding Mr. Right. Listen, check this out. I know you want him. I know you've built your resume. I know you worked through Mr. Wrong and you've identified the things that you did wrong in that relationship and how you got to the place you got to in that relationship. But the thing, the cool thing about finding Mr. Right is that you've got to wait for him. That's right. You got to have some patience because you see, the thing about it is Mr. Right is going to find you only if you wait for him. And when you do find Mr. Right, as long as you've been waiting for him, as soon as he finds you, make him wait for the rest of you. I'm going to tell you something about Mr. Right. Mr. Right, when he comes and when you get him, he's not going to be overly aggressive. He's going to go at your pace. So you've got to make sure that you understand exactly what pace you're going to move at. And you've got to understand yourself well enough and love yourself well enough to trust God when you find the right man. I want to tell you something else about Mr. Wright. One of the problems is you need to understand that Mr. Wright is going to be a man and not a miracle. Let me say that again. He's going to be a man and not a miracle. What do I mean? He's going to be a human. He's going to be a person. He's going to have some imperfections. Now, he should still fit the script for your resume. But as you as you kind of dib and dab in this relationship, you're going to find, well, he does this well, but he doesn't do this well. As long as it doesn't violate your character and doesn't violate your morals, I need you to hang in there. You're not going to find some magical guy that's going to fall out the sky and be perfect. One of the things we get wrong is that we expect Mr. Wright to be Mr. Perfect. If you stop looking for Mr. Perfect, Mr. Wright is going to find you. So expect the man breathing, living, and he makes mistakes. But finding you is not one of his mistakes, and you'll know it because he'll show you how much you mean to him. Thanks for tuning in to Leroy Scott TV.